Never went on here, and I'm watching Willy Wonka. It's the greatest movie ever. Not really, but it's on. So, yeah, it's like 11 o'clock, and I gotta go to Atlanta tomorrow. So, yeah, it's gonna be fun. Uh, picking up my cousin, so I expect to sh be able to shoot him with nerd guns for a little while. So it should be fun. Uh, but anyway, this, this, as the title says, tour of my workshop. Workshop, because uh, technically I don't have a workshop anymore because we moved and basically I work in my room and outside in the deck. So yeah, but first I'm going to give you a promo to nerfnerds.com. Great website. Uh, it's like, it's Nerf Haven basically. Well, it's not Nerf Haven, but personally I like it more because it's the setup of it. It's very nice. Uh, when you first load up the page, this is what you'll see. NerfNerds.com but there's only 48 members right now and it's kind of slow but the posts have all been great and they've all been like helpful in most cases so yeah just uh, give it a look to see it's always great to uh, get involved in a new upcoming uh, website because you see it from the beginning you see all the posts and everything instead of Nerf Haven uh, you have like a vast amount and sometimes it's hard to find exactly one thing because there's so much in there so yeah uh, but Nerf Haven I'm not dissing them because Nerf Haven rocks and that's the basically the original besides Nerf HQ and Foam Universe and places like that but anyway here's a tour of my workshop basically but a special surprise at the end for all of you people who have been watching my videos for the past few months or so you know you may already guess what surprise is but we'll see Okay, so here's everything. Boxes, crap like that. CPVC, PVC. Okay, so let's tour. Uh, these are my shelves. First one, either barrels or plungers, and then a whole bunch of springs. Maverick piece. Uh, right here are my need to get tools like quickly pliers wire cutters exacto knife the perfect screwdriver for a nerf gun uh electrical tapes colorful just black uh white red blue green yellow uh, another flathead screwdriver one of the sets of these little things that I used to drill out I have an inch, half inch, which is perfect for CPVC. And then, of course, drill bits and a magnet piece right here. But yeah. Right here is my writing utensils for when I have ideas. Here are all my PVC parts. I just got a big bag of couplers. Yes, I went shopping like two days ago and I wouldn't make a vid afterwards, but. Honestly, I was having a lot of fun with friends, so I haven't made a vid yet, but yeah. Uh, just got some caps for CPVC. I got 20 CPVC couplers. I have some PVC parts. Then there's this, which may give a surprise a special someone who thinks uh, they know what I'm modding. We'll see. Uh, here are my safety stuff. Here's my safety stuff. Mask, goggles, tubes, uh, gloves over there, like working gloves, like the awesome working gloves that everyone loves. Spare parts that for recent mods, this is only for recent mods, uh, tubing, a whole bunch of uh, front gun long shot parts and uh, crap, uh, titan parts. So yeah, this is my most recent mod, so well, instead of keeping it all on my desk, I keep it in there now. Stephens. I used to use those. Regular aerosol felts, now I use these. I will, uh, I'm making some, hopefully, after I pick up my cousin, which is going to be awesome, because I can't wait to have some fun, because he's a cool, he's a very cool cousin. So yeah, I just got some 20, 20 feet of FBR from uh, some Lowe's. Since we're out in another city, uh, went to that Lowe's and got some FBR. Uh, down here, don't really have any light, but uh, you'll get over it. Down here, other parts, clips, copper barrel, 
regular barrel for front gun of the long shot. Some more clips. Uh, a ball. <laughs> kind of random. Next up are just spare parts just galore. I don't know what's in here. Just a whole bunch of parts. Vulcan chain. Yeah. And then down there in that bag. Crap, you really can't see, can you? Uh, hold on. Oh, I doubt that helped any. Helped any, but who cares? Down there is a Walmart bag, basically, and a zip, a big zip-up bag full of spare parts. Uh, that's a drill. You can't see it, but it's a drill. I wish you could see. Or that I had a flashlight, either one. But you can see that, so it's good. These are my AP reading, summer reading books. <sighs> Sandpaper. Oops. Sandpaper. Spray paint cans that I didn't put it up yet. Uh, masking tape. Uh, here's my other drawers. This is my container that holds all my uh, screws. Like I said, I went shopping, so I got some epoxy for plastics. It's actually pretty good, surprisingly. I just picked it up. Uh, zip ties, colorful. I went shopping, like I said, so I got a whole bunch of glue sticks. So I should be good for a little while. Then these are my work gloves. They're very comfortable. Six minutes, seven minutes, okay. Really comfortable. So, yeah. Next up, Stefan container, regular darts container. It's sorted out into three different parts. But I'm not going to really open those up because it doesn't really matter. You can kind of picture it. Right here used to be a container for Stefan's, but I changed my mind. Now it's a container for just junk. Tape. Vulcan handle. A whole bunch of rubber bands. And then my old Stefan's. A few balls. I don't know, it's just really random in there. Uh, that's like if you have something on your desk and you want to get rid of it, you just throw it in that pile and then sort through it later. But yeah. Alright, so that's it. And now, here's the surprise. Yes, that is what uh, you think it is. I finally got one. It's a Dremel. Uh, cost me forty dollars. Not bad. It's wireless. I got the best wire cordless one they had because I wouldn't be able to go with it, um, move around with it, and so if I don't want to be limited by a plug-in. So yeah, eight minutes. I still got time. Cool. So yeah, I figured I would open it with y'all because this has not been opened yet. So yeah, I'm gonna move from right here and try to open it quickly before. My ten minutes are up. Oh, oh, it's so beautiful. Little carrying bag. Hmm. Let's see how it looks. Ooh, hand guide. Where I won't slow off my hand. Oh. Yep, battery needs to be charged. Not bad though. I got a little taste of what it would be like. But hey, it's cordless. And it comes with like 50 different parts. So grinding and sanding. And oh, I don't have to use sandpaper that much anymore. I'm so happy. More grinding a hex screwdriver. Oh my gosh, this is awesome. Probably a charger. And then a kit to hold all my stuff in. So, dude, this is awesome. I'm going to do my research and read. So, yeah, Nerf Man 101 saying, sign off.